I think we have a new king when it comes to no name brand, small RGB LED lights. And of course, it's a company you've never heard of. So that's why I'm here to introduce it to you. Stay tuned. What's going on guys? My name is Ty Turner. And if this is your first time on this channel, you gotta know that this channel is not designed to show you how to take better pictures. It's designed to show you how to get money off taking better pictures or video or color grading or editing. That is the purpose of this channel. There's a million channels designed to show you how to take great images, but none to show you how to feed your family with that great image. And that's what we do here. And in doing so, we talk about gear that you may not be familiar with, from names you're not familiar with, to show you that you don't need to go out and break the bank to be competitive and to start making money with what you do. I like to find diamonds in the rough that are no name, maybe even knockoff or cheap brands that are a fraction of the price that will help you create imagery or help you with a project so that you can afford the bigger and better things. This is not the industry to try to jump off the deep end and just go out and buy reds. You got to start somewhere. Today, I'm here to talk about a small, compact LED RGB light by a company called Soitu Photo. I don't it, listen. I'm gonna post it on the screen. You're gonna see it. You're gonna have the same problem pronouncing it as I do. However, it's a dope light, and we're gonna get into the top five reasons why I like this particular light. Number five is the fact that the build quality is dope. It is all metal. It is solid. It is heavy. If I'm, listen, it's not waterproof, but it's built so solid that it looks like it's waterproof. It's not waterproof, though. Don't don't put that on me if you're out swimming with it. It's not waterproof. <laughs> Nothing on the site says it's waterproof, but it's so solid that it looked like it could be. It even comes with multiple mounting points, as well as a shoe adapter, cold shoe, of course, built right into the side of this thing. The number four thing that I really like, and if you have used other companies, RGB lights with little screens on the back, you can relate. The fact that the menus are in plain English and they're very easy to use. Why does this even matter? Why do you care? Because a lot of these little lights have what's called scenarios or scenes where they offer different things like fire trucks or police where it'll make different lights. Now on other LED devices, it's just called scene one, scene two, scene three. Whereas on this device, they have it labeled lightning, fire truck, police car, ambulance. I am so thankful for that because dealing with other lights, you don't know what scene six is and you gotta sit there and wait for it to start blinking and be like, oh, I think that's a TV. I think that's lightning. I think that's a candle. I don't know. Let me go look at the instructions. So I wanna thank you guys for adding that to the freaking LED screen. Thank you, big companies who make similar products. If you're listening, you might wanna spell it out. The number three thing I like about it, which probably is the most important, is the fact that it is super bright. It is super bright. I have it as a fill light, which is lighting the side of my face, which is bouncing off a bounce card, and it is at 26%, and it gotta be a good arm's length away from me. It is super bright for a little, LED light. Could I shoot an interview with three of them? Probably. If I have a camera that's great in low light, I could probably shoot an interview with three of them. I'm not going to lie to you. Also keep in mind that it is bicolor. So it goes from 2,500 Kelvin up to 8,500 Kelvin and you still have RGB. You still can do some crazy dynamic lighting with this particular light. Number two thing I like is a big, big battery. 3300 milliamp battery, which is designed to give you three hours of usage 
at 100% at 8,500 Kelvin. That means it's giving you everything at about three hours. So for me, three hours is perfect. Number one is if you've watched my last video with the LED lights, then you know the price range of normal LED lights is usually somewhere around 150 um, for a good one, 200 maybe for a good one, 70 to 80 for a cheap one that's just bi-color. This is bi-color plus RGB. It's super dope and it's built better than all of them. So do I have any dislikes about this particular light? Not really, no. I wish it charged faster. C can we ask for that at $110? Is that being too much? Is that being picky? I think it's being picky. I'm not even going. We're just going. We're just going. We'll just scratch that one. We'll take that one off the list. Um, I don't really have any dislikes for this light. I like little RGB lights. I'll probably go and buy six of them and just have them in my bag so that when I'm doing interviews, I can light the background like crazy, different colors, and I don't have to deal with gels or big RGB lights or extra batteries or none of that. I can just lay these things around, get those little bitty tripods, boom, bang, pow. I got a dopely lit shot, dopely lit. I'm coining that. If you got a dopely lit picture, uh, hashtag dopely lit. Uh, maybe I'll spell it and put it, whatever. Hashtag it. That's my hashtag. Now I'm on hashtag or tag me in Flash Film Academy on Instagram. I want to see your dopely lit shots. But I do like this light. I'll post a link in the description. If you have any other questions about this light, let's talk about it, man. Let's talk in the descriptions. Tell me how you feel about it. If you got one. Or if you have a RGB LED lights and you want to ask some questions on how it compared to that, let's talk about it. I mean, there are just some dope things about this light. You can pick the hue and the saturation for a color. It's pretty dope. With other RGB lights, you can just pick a color and then you can power it up or down and that's it. You can't control the saturation. That's pretty dope for a $110 light. Anyway, I know you guys got stuff to do. I'll post a link in the description. We can talk in the comments and I will see you guys in the next video.